do we have here? Another scammer. Wow. Crazy. Whoever slid their card here. Yeah. Gotta check with your account. Skimmers at gas stations. Mercedes locks faster acceleration behind a $1,200 annual paywall. I am an avid user of torrenting software, and I cannot wait for somebody, typically with a Russian username, to go out of their way to drop the, you know, exploit package for cars like this. I cannot wait until you can sit down and download cracking software for your Mercedes vehicle, just so that you can have access to the mechanical parts that make your car accelerate. Nobody in their right mind should be funding this. We do not need car DLC, all right? You don't need to do that. No subscriptions, no extra downloadable content. No, no, no. I bought an $80,000 car. I want to use all the components that came with my $80,000 car. This is the reset process for my GE smart bulb. I chucked it into the trash after a few tries. Is your GE smart bulb not working? Well, here is the old reset sequence. Turn on for eight seconds, turn off for two seconds. Turn on for two seconds, turn off for two seconds. Turn on for two seconds, turn off for two seconds. Turn on for two seconds, turn off for two seconds. Turn on for eight seconds, turn off for two seconds. Spirit Airlines seat auction outright lies to customers about other bids. Despite receiving an outbid notice four days before my flight, I was later congratulated and billed for winning my seats just two hours prior to departure. On top of all of that, the plane was nearly empty. Your first mistake was flying with spirit. I don't think there's any destination worth going to that you need to put in this much effort just to fly on spirit. It makes no sense. You'd genuinely be better off walking to wherever you're trying to go to. Twitter requiring a Twitter blue subscription for all DMs, even those concerning public safety. Come on, everybody has a price. You wanna see what the NYPD has to tell you? You wanna know if there's a serial killer in your neighborhood? You know that's not free information. Come on, cough it up, give me five bucks. Google shows four ads before the actual website. Oh, let me guess, you tried to search for OBS, yup. <laughs> Good luck, there's nothing but a minefield until you find the real website. I hope you like adware, cause you're gonna be downloading that and not OBS. But hey, Google needs to eat too, so your computer needs to be sacrificed. Six fake download buttons. The real one is at the bottom of the page. Oh my god, I've never seen so much malware on one page, all just to download YouTube? Why aren't you using the App Store or Google Play Store? I don't know what the story is, but hey man, I hope you click the right one. I mean, it seems like you know which one it is, but I wonder how you found that out. How many phones were cooked before you found the real <laughs> download button? Twitter recently changed their logo to X, and I almost pressed that X button, all because I thought it was the close button in embed tweet. What do you think the over-under is on Twitter not existing in the next year and a half? Because, you know, all of this radical change to the platform is just completely destroying what made Twitter fun. I really enjoy that almost all of the limiters have been lifted off of the platform. I've been seeing a lot more crazier tweets, and that's been funny. That's been great. But also, the usability of the website has completely been annihilated. So what do you think the chances are of this platform existing? Throw those numbers in the comments down below, because my guess is that it's a 50-50 chance that this platform goes tits up in the next one. What, 10 months? The supermarket using pink lights in the meat section to hide the fact that their ham is fatty and gray. That is bold. No fear at all. It's almost astounding that somebody who runs this grocery store is bold enough to tell lies like that. Completely obvious lies with no fear of losing any sort of customer base. That is insane. This is either a major grocery store brand or the only grocery store brand in that area. Good grief. At that point, what do you do? Other than, you know, exposing them on social media, what else can you do to change this type of behavior? This is just abhorrent. Trying to switch to a cheaper plan on T-Mobile, and this is all I'm allowed to see. No changing allowed. You're currently on the best plan. Based on your usage data, it looks like the plan you're on is best suited for your needs. Your current plan, one plan. You don't need to change, you don't need to upgrade, you don't need to downgrade. Keep giving us the money that you can't afford to give us, or you just won't be able to call your parents or friends or loved ones. Give us your money. Cough it up. All right, time to play some Minecraft. Are you serious? I have to update my 
windows to play a game i swear to god microsoft really goes out of their way to make sure that every single one of their updates is insanely just inconvenient and in the way now granted i like the updates they're meant to make your system function better they're meant to make your system a little bit more secure but if you want people to update their operating systems in a way that is actually beneficial to them you need to do it in a way that is less intrusive come on now Come on now, you really think that we're this stupid? I mean, seriously, the packaging is plastic. We can see the deception. That's not two free hot dogs, bro. You just took it out the package and sold it to me. That's it. The definition of a negative bargain is this image. Ah, you needed a controller for your Switch, huh? And you didn't want to cough up 60 bucks for the Pro Controller, so you bought you bought the power a1 it is affordable don't get me wrong those controllers are pretty cheap but what you lose in price you gain in frustration and that's just the world we live in a world where a 25 dollars controller has a proprietary usb port you can say things like how do i pay my bill or my internet isn't working y'all charge me after i canceled service get me a representative what was that y'all charged me after i canceled my service get me a representative one more time Billing representative. Sorry, could you say that again? We all want it to be real. We all want to come across that zero dollar and zero cent deal on Amazon. But we all know that it's just a shipping scam. That's all it is. This is a $15 t-shirt. It's not a $3 t-shirt. It's certainly not a free t-shirt. It's a $13 t-shirt. Well, nearly free. 80 cents. Yeah, no one's buying an 80 cent t-shirt. But what really gets me about this little Amazon screenshot is the fact that there's still a 25% coupon. Hey, did we resolve your issue? No, you didn't. Oh, well, how easy or difficult was it to solve your issue? Go ahead and give us the answer down below. Either very easy, easy, or neutral. Ooh, a subreddit favorite. We love ourselves a $400 or $500 textbook that doesn't even have binding. You're trying to tell me that you couldn't give me glue? You're trying to tell me that within the price of $500, you couldn't afford cardboard? You want me to supply the binding? You want me to go down to the store and pick up a binder for your useless strategies for technical communication textbook? I genuinely thought college was all about higher education, but really, it was just four years of getting violently scammed by everyone and everything because I was a naive young adult. For the love of God in all that is holy, billing representative. Just, just that one guy, can you get me his number? Can you say that again? I'm going to throw my phone through the window. Ooh, a freshly made burrito. I'm about to eat this. I'm about to tear it up. Ah, uh, looks like someone got there before me. Looks like someone ripped my burrito in half and scammed me out of my hard-earned money. I love it when that happens. This is my favorite part of eating food from the grocery store. Realizing that the food was a scam and then having to sit here with two gimped burritos. Oh my God, I love living on this planet. Okay, fireworks, look at that. A ton of fireworks, monster tubes. These are about to be big, man. These are about to be awesome. Let's take a look at them. Oh my God, they are so big. They're the size of a Tootsie Roll. I can't believe I spent money on this. Look, man, you guys charged me a couple hundred bucks. I just want my money back. Can you please, please get me a billing representative? I missed that. Say that again. Did you know our servers survive on your tipping kindness? I didn't know that. You know what I do know though? That you could help them survive by giving them a livable wage and not asking me to pay 20% on top of already overpriced food. This dating app only lets you send one VIP message and it's 16 bucks a month. Help keep our community safe. To fight against spam and scam, we only allow non-VIP users to send one messages for free. If you want to send unlimited messages, please upgrade to VIP membership. Because scammers definitely don't have money and would absolutely not use this as a loophole to send people phishing messages. That would never happen. See, that's why we need you to pay 16 bucks a month so that you can send people messages with the hopes of them messaging you back. Isn't this a great business model for us? For you, probably not, but for us, we're doing pretty well. I just bought a second Lamborghini, isn't that sick? 
What's up everybody, it's your boy Aileris aka Panda Daddy and I hope you enjoyed today's video and if you did let me know in the comments down below and leave a like if you like the video and if you're new to my channel go ahead and subscribe fam. What you doing watching videos and not subscribing and if you're old make sure you hit that bell so you can get these notifications every time. Go ahead and check out the community tab because there's another content poll for next week so if you want to put in your two cents if you want to have control over the future go ahead and take a look at that poll and vote on the video that you want to see and as always we gotta thank the patreon supporters that make content like this possible a big thank you to toasty comfy ghosty ironic pfp mike my zoom dams pool sleepy dragon ducky aiden loves aileris power lover sherry morrison tron destroy 23 fitz chivalry din corda co connor purvis s16 squish rare days mr bean my golden experience james tucker bmx 30 cinnamon sticks scott the fake musician buckethead samantha bellhart zach f bloody hunter dunder nas hawk swiss patreon user and noah thank you so much for your support it is greatly appreciated and if you want to help support the channel there's two links in the description one of my merch store and one of my patreon both funds go directly into the channel so we can maintain what's happening here and as always stay zesty